Thank you. She was my first boss in D.C. How did you know her? We met overseas. That's a response any politician would be proud of. You don't seem like a Capitol Hill type. You're too scraggly to be CIA or FBI. Military, then. Special ops. My beard always gives me away. Oh, it's not the beard. It's the shoes. I'm Rebecca Bowen. Clay. Spencer. You have some good stories to tell today? Can I try my opening out on you? I'm not sure if the tone is appropriate for the occasion. Yeah, go for it. To this day, Nicole Marsden is still the best boss I've ever had. And that includes the three years I worked for myself. That's great. The whole point of these things is to get a little break from the sadness. When you say you met her overseas, you mean in Yemen. You were there when she died. I get it. I know that you can't talk about what happened. It's just... No one seems to know what happened. Ambassador Marsden put everyone else's needs above her own. She died fighting for what she believed in. That's not surprising. That was Nicole. So, uh, so what about you? Your job? I'm the communications director for a global security consultant. You prefer the private sector? Oh, I fly first class, so yes. You think you're having the kind of impact you want? Well, you tell me. You're the one out there waging war. I'm out there eliminating threats to freedom. A soldier with an idealistic streak. Oh, but Nicole loved you. We, uh, we didn't spend much time together, but she definitely made an impression. I'd consider her a hero. I think her family would appreciate hearing from you. Come on, I'll introduce you. <laughs>